Oh my god, I actually was craving Mexican food yesterday. How did AI know that? <laughs> Thank you, AI, for recommending me this restaurant. Hey, hey Catpigs! Welcome back to our channel! <laughs> for today's video, we're letting ChatGPT choose what we eat for this entire day. Yay! <laughs> ChatGPT and AI is super, super big these days. ChatGPT is super AI. Oh. You fucking dumbass. So I was like, you know what? Why not let ChatGPT control what we eat for the day? It's probably really ah, smarter Emily, than Emily! What? My fucking piercing, bro. <laughs> Can we not fight right now? Oh like, fuck, it hasn't Emily. even been like five minutes. I'm excited to let ChatGPT choose what we eat for today because I'm sure they have much better ideas than we do because we eat like the same things every day. Like, they are such picky eaters. Rare! Okay, guys, we're sitting at our computer right now and we're about to ask ChatGPT some questions about what we should eat for lunch. We already ate breakfast-ish, so we're gonna skip that. What should I ask this thing? Let's first ask, like, what is a unique dish we can try out? Like a a new, cool, weird looking. Hey, queen. Hey, queen. Hello. Hello. How, How can, can I, I assist, assist you today? I feel like ChatGPT low-key just talks in a British accent. <laughs> Give times. me one random and very unique dish to try out. I'll just ask that. Vietnamese style Vietnamese. rice paper roll salad. I don't want to. I don't want to do this. What is a new, cool, unique, interesting <laughs> dish to try out? Please give me a good answer, please. Buddha bowl, Buddha bowl sushi, sushi rolls. rolls. Do they know we're Asian? Because it's been giving us Asian <laughs> dishes in the past. Boy, what the hell? Why? I don't want to try Buddha bowl sushi rolls. I feel like I've eaten that like a lot of times. Just say non-Asian. <laughs> <laughs> what is a new, cool, unique, interesting restaurant in New York City for lunch? Jet Cool and Hyde, Hyde Club. Club. A club. A club. It's an American restaurant. It's a house chic. It's permanently closed. <laughs> why? Why is it telling us permanently closed restaurants regenerate? Oh my god, this this thing is stupid. Ha ha ha, Quantas Mexicana. It's a trendy Mexican restaurant. Okay, I'm down for Mexican right now. Unless it's, it's fucking closed. Closed. <laughs> AI has been giving us closed restaurants so far. Oh, it's open. Oh, okay. Yay. <laughs> Click on it. I want to see how it looks. Ooh. Oh, okay. Wait. Look at the photos. Oh, okay. This place looks okay, slay. Okay. I've never seen this place before. Um, I guess we're gonna be going there. <laughs> we found our lunch location, guys. <laughs> it's ha ha ha. ha, ha, ha. Oh, it has your last name in it. Oh. oh it fucking ha, knows, bro. It knows. AI knows us. FBI, dude. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I fucking see you. <laughs> We're filming a video right now, so yeah, don't judge us. That's why I've been giving us ancient foods. <laughs> Mayama Evelyn. <laughs> <laughs> Actual cricket. All right, guys, let's go eat. Come on, squad. Guys, it's so nice outside today. It's 77 degrees in New York. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is my fit today. It's my fit today. Loving this top. Love it. It's so cute. Loving this top. We're going to ha 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 Mexicana because AI told us to. But she won't let me braid it. Can you guys stop Emily, annoying me? I hope you know I'm inclusive to everyone and I welcome everyone, even you with the rat tail. This is just a piece of hair I forgot to put in my clip. Oh, don't be ashamed <laughs> of your rat tail. Oh my no, god, guys. Bro. I'm gonna ask AI what should I do with my annoying sisters. Just send them home. I'll gladly go home. Yeah, me too. I wonder what AI would actually say if I'm like, what do I do with AI's annoying gonna sisters? say something like this like, talk to your sisters and communicate. <laughs> Go to better help. That's why I always ask my Snapchat AI. What? I'm always like, Wait, there's a Snapchat AI team. Snapchat I always AI. ask my AI for Spanish homework. Boy, not answers. Help. Schools. Like Google Translate. I'll ask. Expose like, her. I'll ask like what this Let's go means. schools. <laughs> schools. I said they're gonna hear you. <laughs> schools. Guys, I smell food. Do you guys smell it? Yes. It smells so good, but I don't know if it's the ha 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 Mexicana. Could be something else. There's a bunch of restaurants near this area, guys. Okay, this is Whole Foods. Our guess is that it's inside Whole Foods. Guys, this restaurant is literally in Whole Foods. Yeah. Like, how did AI even find this? 
This is like a whole buffet. It's like food. a nice, like, wow. This whole food is Gucci. Oh, whoa. Outside. And you can go outside here. Oh, we see it. We found it. We should get nachos. nachos. And then there's like the special Let's cheese. get a burrito. Oh my god, I actually was craving Mexican food yesterday. How did AI know that? They didn't. They didn't. No, AI definitely knew. Guys, we got our food. This is our lunch. Ooh, I can't wait to open it up. It smells so good. Whoa, that looks so good. Oh my gosh, taco. Whoa, what the heck? Whoa. Yummy. This looks so cool. It's just me. Welcome to my mukbang. <laughs> Guys, look at this nacho. I'm gonna try it. Ready? Damn, that's a lot of guac. Damn. Mm. Mm. This place is actually bomb. Look at this huge bite. Guys, I haven't had nachos in so long. If AI didn't recommend this place to us, we would never have found it. Never. Let's try one of their tacos. We're gonna try the tacos now. I love a lot of lime. Mmm. That looks delish. I love cilantro. I love lime. This is the pollo, the chicken taco. It's good. Oh my god. I love the cilantro. Eight out of ten. Oh wow, eight out of ten. The cilantro is just so buzz. Okay, ready? Definitely got their cilantro from Whole Foods. The cilantro is so, so good. Guys, every food right now is a hit so far. I'm gonna try the next taco. Last bite of the chicken taco. This, this is really good. Yeah. Mm. Okay, this is the next taco. Oh, yeah. Yum. This is the chorizo. I'm so excited to try the burrito. I'm so mm. I'm gonna try Mm. I like the chicken one better though. It's still mm. good though. This one has more like veggies. Still really good. I like the chicken better. I don't like the paprika in this. Thank you AI for recommending me this restaurant. I need more water. Our last dish is this burrito bowl. I'm kind of scared to dig into this. Whoa. What the heck? They said this is their most popular dish. This loki looks like a dish we had in Mexico. All right, guys, I guess, should I take the first bite? Mmm, it doesn't taste like a regular burrito. I feel like it tastes very like potato-y. It's very like mushy. I give it a seven out of 10. What was your favorite dish from here? Chicken taco. Honestly, AI is great if you're feeling indecisive. If you don't know what to eat, just ask <coughs> AI and be like, hey, what should I eat today? In fact, no cam. There's this girl that has my, the same English teacher as me, and she used AI to write her whole speech, and she got a zero on it and had to redo it. No way. How'd she find out? How'd I find out? How'd the, How teacher, did the find teacher find out? Because when you submit it, like the submission place like can like um, Detect detects it? it. Really? Yeah. That's why, guys, if you're gonna use AI for homework, put it into Colbot. And have it <laughs> paraphrase. <her>. Bro. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. What the fuck is that? Pollen. I just got pollen in my nose. <laughs> We're full. I'm very full. That was a good lunch. <laughs> I rate this lunch a nice, a good solid 8.5 out of 10. I rated a 7 out of 10. Yay! Influencer in the wild. Why is Erica standing like that? Why are you standing like that? So we just finished lunch, but we're feeling some sort of sweets. We want something sweet, like a dessert. So we're gonna ask AI what's a great dessert place. I hope AI picks a good place, because I'm in some coma right now. A nice dessert would be so good. Give me one refreshing dessert in New York City. I love myself. That was so random. <laughs> okay, why is AI taking so long? Like, give me one refreshing dessert to eat in New York City. It's taking so long. AI is dumb, guys. What are you doing? Why are you smiling quickly in the camera? Because <laughs> I just love myself. Guys, this AI is actually not working. Is this like just me? Ooh. Mango sticky rice. Okay. What is that? One refreshing dessert to try in New York City is the mango sticky rice at Thai restaurants or dessert shops. Honestly, that doesn't Switch sound bad. Sticky rice. I want to see what it looks like. Ooh. It's rice with mango, but it's sticky? Yeah. That's so interesting. Oh, is this the sticky mango? Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm calling, right? Yeah. We got our mango rice. We 
to go there so we can eat it at home. Hey guys, we got our sticky rice mango dessert. Woo! It's our it's first. Warm. Oh, whoa. <laughs> it's our first time trying this dessert, and I'm actually really excited because I love Thai food. Thai food is one of my favorite foods. I think AI is. We asked for something refreshing. Wow. It smells mm. good though. It smells like mango, like boba. Or no something. way. Whoa. The rice looks a little bit weird. I'm pretty sure I saw Lisa from Blackpink post a story of her eating this. And she's like, mm, it's so good. I'm like, oh, I want to try that now. Cheers. Mm. I'm really bad with textures, guys. Like, I mean, like the rice doesn't taste like anything. It's mainly, it. mainly about texture. Yeah, I don't like the texture. I can see why people like it. It's throwing me off a little bit because every time I eat rice, it's always savory, not sweet. So eating something sweet with rice kind of throws me off a little bit, but it's not bad. I think it's just a ton of addicting. Mm -hmm. It's addicting. The mango is actually so good. I actually really like the mango. I kind of like it. Yeah, it's actually like, do you like it with the rice? Yeah. Mm. I can't really like describe it. Mm. Why are you wearing this hat? <laughs> I don't know, I just felt like it. The condensed milk with the rice, it basically tastes like, like rice a cake. sweet rice cake. I give this a good 9 out of 10. I actually like it. Yeah. I give it an 8 out of 10. I give it a 6 out of 10. Would I eat this again? Yes, I would probably eat it again. This is the type of food where you crave it randomly. I don't think I'd ever crave it. Really? I think I'd order it if I was at like a Thai restaurant. Low key, rice with condensed milk, guys. Why is it kind of good? Try it by itself with, without the mango. Right? It tastes like a sweet rice cake. That was really, really yummy. So we'll catch you guys for dinner. Bye. Hey guys, we're back for dinner. Dinner. Wait, dinner. I said that so slow. Hey, hey guys, guys, we're back for dinner. Hey guys, we're back for dinner. <laughs> hey guys, we're back for dinner. <laughs> we're asking AI to choose our dinner. Guys, I'm gonna wear this. Wait, can you ask our AI if I should wear this out to dinner? Should my sister wear a hat to dinner? Are you? Are you? <laughs> AI? Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Okay, I'll wear it. Guys, AI is like that smart kid in class that talks a lot. <laughs> <laughs> and like we never ask. It always seems like law just mm, deciding whether or not <laughs> where to wear a hat. Mm, it would depend on one dress code, two occasion, three venue, and four your sister's comfort. <laughs> like shut up, I just asked yes or no. AI is very detailed like that. What should we eat for dinner? Give oh. me one unique interesting restaurant to eat for go for dinner. One unique interesting restaurant to consider for dinner in New York City is Jekyll and Hyde Club. We Park. searched this up for lunch. It was oh, Jekyll and Hyde Club. This is the one that yeah. was permanently closed. That's permanently closed. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Why are you having a conversation? You fucking dumbass. Apologies for the outdated information. Gotham Bar and Grill. Let's see what this Gotham Bar and Grill is all about, according to AI. <laughs> Closes 9.30. Oh, okay. It's $4 stars, so AI thinks I'm rich. Oh, this so they really give fancy. you bite-sized food. I'm not feeling that right now. I'm gonna go to like... Okay, like honestly... It does not look that good. Pass. Regenerate. Give me popular restaurants. With Bernadine, Ooh, that's like food restaurant. Three Michelin stars. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Give me a number. Seven. Oh, seven. ABC Kitchen, a farm table restaurant located flat iron. Oh, it's like um, American. Okay. Well, can I see the vibes? Oh, okay. We're about to decide on this one restaurant. We're gonna call if they have a spot, and if we do, Thank then we're gonna go there. ABC restaurant. ABC <gasps> Kitchen, I you. Hi. Do you guys have any spot for three people today? So we do have availability this afternoon, so you- Alright, we're going to ABC Kitchen! See you there! See you there! It is 7.30 currently and it's still bright outside, which makes me so happy. I love summer! I'm so excited for summer this summer. Okay guys, we have arrived actually, but we don't know where this where place is. is. These are just like stores. It's their mattress room. Wait, I what? Mattress this room. is ABC Kitchen? Question mark. Imagine this place just be like non existent. This is the yellowtail, yellowfin tuna tartare. Let's give it a taste. I rate this a 6 out of 10. What about you? Yeah, this is 
alright. Not nothing too special. It's a flavor I've never tasted in my life. Filled with mushrooms. Eric is trying to steal this face. <laughs> Why would you do that? And then we put it in your bag. So it doesn't spill. 20 bucks to drink this. Ew! Whoa, the food looks so much better. Wait, this is a fried chicken? This is fried chicken. <laughs> hamburger! $29 hamburger. <laughs> Wait, I want to try the chicken. Popcorn Sunday. Ooh. Let's do a taste test. That's good, I am. What do you rate this? 